Hi everybody, welcome again to the Joy of Trucking. Kevin here, solo OTR driver for Werner Enterprises. I'm at the Fontana, California terminal. There's my trusty steed sitting over there, Kenny Riggs. Uh, I thought I'd give you a little look around. We've got a big parking lot here. Look at all these bobtails. There's a big trailer parking area over there. Lots of dumpsters. Oh my gosh. There's always a wrecked tractor sitting here too. I guess they rebuild them or salvage parts off them and maybe it's good to remind drivers what can happen if you're not careful out there. A couple of things about this about this place. Uh, it's just off I-10. Fontana. You come down Valley Boulevard and you turn down Calabash, a little side street, and there's the guard shack down there. That's where you enter. I came in last night, there were cars and trucks lining that street. It was a pretty pretty tight approach, and you gotta make a very sharp turn to get into the guard shack. But you don't exit that way. You exit over yonder, back onto Valley Boulevard directly. There's another gate there, and you pass by the Roadmaster School, on your way out. This is the service area. You see all the bays. There's no truck wash here. And farther down that building by the guard shack is where the offices are, driver's lounge, laundry, uh, store. This is where I got my truck assignment here in uh, April, where I first got my Kenworth. So a lot of happy memories there. And I've been here a couple of times before with my trainer. And I've been here a couple of times since. Uh, there's also a really good taco truck that comes by here. Good stuff. But one of my favorite things when I'm here is to go out on Valley Boulevard, take a right and walk a couple of blocks. You come to a little, a little place that serves Mexican food, which uh, really surprised me because they had uh, liver. And they actually make you a liver taco. The uh, Spanish word for liver is hígado. And I like liver, so that's the first time I had a liver taco. I'm going back there today and uh, have me a liver taco for supper. What on earth is this thing? Look at this big old snake going into the side of this truck. What's this all about? Looks to me like a Peterbilt day cab. It's missing the gas tank. Where's the fuel tanks? What are these big boxes on here? Holy smokes, I think I found an electrical truck. All those boxes must be the batteries. That's a lot of battery. What do you think that weighs? And this thing is charging it. That's a big cord. So I was talking to the mechanic. He said, yeah, this is, a, this is an electric truck. I said, what's it look like under the hood? He says, oh, it's just a mess of wires. I mean, it's not like when you lift the hood on a, on a diesel and all, you see all this huge engine. And he says, this is just a mess of wires. And, uh, I looked in the cab, it's obviously somebody's ride, so I'm not gonna open the door and climb in and check it out, but uh, the controls look the same. You got a steering wheel, you got turn signal and levers and speedometer and RPMs and all that stuff. Man, that's a really thick cord. And the connector there for the charge, wow. Yeah, I wonder what it weighs with all those batteries. And somebody in the in the lounge was saying this truck's been here for a while. They, they're using it. It's the only one, though. So I guess they're using it for uh, local runs because the uh, electric trucks don't really have the range for long haul yet. And that's very interesting. That's the first time I saw an electric truck. All right. Well, that's it for the tour of Fontana, California, Werner Terminal. Uh, hope you got something from this. It's big, spacious, it's right next to the noisy interstate, interstate. but uh, yeah, I had a peaceful night here last night. So uh, give us a thumbs up. Let's see your comments. Hit that subscribe button. All right, see you out there on the road.
right, here we are inside the terminal in Fontana. You come in the door, there's an ATM machine. Here's a store. Being Sunday, it's closed, but there's some stuff you can buy for your truck. And sort of a reception desk. We've got offices down here. A nice picture of CL on the wall. Here's our showers. One, two, three. And the lounge area. Got some nice lazy boys, some tables where you can sit down and eat. There's a big screen TV. And the computer room. We're doing your training, water fountains, restrooms, a couple more showers over here, and a laundry room. Down the hall here, you see vending machines and a microwave. There's your microwaves, there's your vending machines, and whoa, oh, pinball. Wow. Alright, here's La Cascada. Just a little eatery along Valley Boulevard. It's about a 10 minute walk from the Werner Terminal. I'm gonna go in there and see what's what's for lunch. And on that walk you'll see a lot of trucks for sale. A whole bunch of truck dealerships. It's just amazing how many they got for sale. And uh, it was funny when I passed the Werner Fleet Sales parking lot, it was empty. <laughs> And here's Iga though for lunch. We've got some salsa, we got some chips, got some tortillas. I can make myself some liver tacos. Just to wrap up, uh, lunch was fantastic. I got my weekly dose of liver. I got to hang out in a cool neighborhood mom and pop Mexican cafe. Uh, Couple of doors down from there is a little a little market, AB market. Uh, doesn't look like much on the outside, but you can you can get what you need there. It's a little neighborhood grocery store, so I picked up some uh, some provisions for the coming few days and uh, walked on back here to the terminal. And uh, when I came in the gate, uh, a woman approached me, told me her name is Tanya. So shout out to Tanya new Werner driver. She said our videos were helping her quite a bit. That's really good news. I'd like to know that what we're doing here is, is worthwhile and, and a good thing for people. So thank you, thank you, Tanya. And I'm surprised she recognized me from so far off. She has really good eyes. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna spend the rest of my uh, reset just chilling here. Uh, it's like four in the afternoon. Uh, and I'll be back on the road tomorrow morning. So thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this little side sidebar here of my reset in Fontana, California. Give it a thumbs up, put those comments below, and hit that subscribe button. And we'll see you next time. Bye-bye.